Welcome back, y'all. Thank you guys so much for sticking around. Give it up one time for The Fix, everybody. Give it up for The Fix. An amazing, amazing band. I'm very blessed to have them here every single night. I really appreciate it. Well, I'm very blessed to have this guy. He is a world, world-renowned champion in jiu-jitsu. He also runs his own school called the North Broadway Jiu-Jitsu. Give it up for Brian Gidry, everybody. <laughs> So, Brian Gidry, everybody, give it up. Brian Gidry. How you been, man? Been good, really good. I Thank really you. do appreciate you coming in and being a part of this, you know. I appreciate the uh, the gi. Is Courtesy that how you, pro you properly say it? That's a gi, absolutely. I've been, I've been watching a lot of Karate Kid. You got it. So. daniel son. Yeah, aye. Aye, son. Aye. Aye. Right? Perfect. Ramen noodles? Yes. No, that's, I don't know. Sushi. Sushi? Sushi, ramen noodles. Uh, Orange, orange chicken, maybe? Mm. Is that racist? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Not if you enjoy it. I love it, so it can't be racist, right? If, it, right. if you, you know, uh, I love fried chicken too. So okay. you know, we all get along with too. that. Absolutely. Everybody likes fried chicken. <laughs> anyway, so, so tell me about your school. When did you get it started? You know, the whole nine. Sure. In 2006, I started my school on North Broadway. It was above a biker bar called Shady Jacks. So every night after class, we'd have to go down and get a couple scuffles in the bar. Right. But uh, we were there for five years, no heat, no air conditioning. You get up to 110 in the summer, cold as hell in the winter. I mean, speaking of heat right now, I mean, I'm going to be honest. This is uh, hot. I'm, I'm sweating a little it's bit, like man. Like in, in places that are like the uh, that oh, yeah. you do not you dare not speak of. The Gentlemen, do not speak of Absolutely. the uh, the sweat that is yes. coming out of the orifice of my body right now. It's like wearing a moving blanket. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's like I have a hanger like a wire hanger is like over my chest. And that's a new one, There's it doesn't some, budge, it's like yeah, cardboard. It's, they starts the hell out of this thing, man. They do. They starts the hell and out of this. Sharp. So, so after you moved over that, uh, when you put in the new place yes. in the biker bar, That's right. what did you do after that? I mean, I know you guys moved to maybe we, we two moved, other places, right? Yeah, we right? moved uh, to Vandevener, we were there for four years, and now we're on the hill on Marconi across from, from okay. Pasta's on the hill, so lots of good pasta. And you're on, a, oh, so you're out there around the Italians. Yes. The Italians. And my last name ends in a Y, which is sometimes a vowel, so they allowed me to move to the hill. Oh, they Otherwise, <laughs> they would have said, they're like, oh, it ends with an N. No, yeah, I don't no, think so. I don't no, think so. we're not going to do that. That's um, right. Why is it? Okay, you're in. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. So, um, so I understand that you were going to kind of throw me around a little bit, right? I can do that. Sure. <laughs> I'm just going to, I'm going to at least look like I'm a BA for like two seconds while I stand like this. That's right. So, um, right, this is how you, this is how you stand, right? This is how you get your man stand. This is like, how you stand? If you, got, you got the stance down right there. Like this, right? Yeah. White belt, white belt. And then it's like, <laughs> right? I didn't feel nothing. Karate man bruise on the Karate, inside. Karate, you know, like you know, like Tai Chi. You flow like water. Flow, flow like water. That's, uh, I can't, I can't win. I can't win. Anyway, so okay. you're gonna teach me some moves, right? We can, we can go over some, some basic throws. This one. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> that was a very uh, demented. Uh, That's right. Rendition so, of that. I'm hoping but that thank we, you, Ice. Thank I'm you. I'm hoping that we land on this mat here, but I really don't know where we're going to end up. So I think we should be, <laughs> we should be fine. So here's a, a basic that we're working on tonight in my class that I just left from. So we're going to do this lock here where I take his hand. Let's say he, he's hit or he's got the back of my neck. He's holding okay. me. I turn. Now I have his arm, and I'm going to put it here. Okay. okay. Now, from this position, I'm going to step. You're going to roll over this shoulder so your I'm shoulder gonna... doesn't pop out. So it, just take a step back. Okay. okay. So as I step here. I'm going to roll. Well, as I throw, either 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 your shoulder's going to come out or you're going to roll that way. Okay. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> nice. Nice. Shoulder still attached. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little bit clumped. So that was a basic uh, key lock throw. So, so we could see that again, or I could show the back, back attack if he attacked. Do it again? Okay, I'll see it again. Okay. The crowd has spoken. No, the fix spoken. Are you not, not entertained? Fair. They just want to see me die. Okay. So he's got the back of my head. 
I turn my body up, I get the key lock. Huh. I step my feet together. Key lock throw. You don't want to lose to a guy in Argyle socks because you, you're supposed to beat him. If you lose to him, you got more problems. <laughs> nice, right. nice. Else? Yeah, let's do this. So, so I'd say I'm one last move. I'm hanging out in the bar out. and the cast show comes up behind me with glasses on. I'm like, excuse me, upstairs. Yeah. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. I'm going to step out of the bar. Oh. oh. I'm telling you, yeah, if we didn't have the mats, it would not be fun. So, give it up for that, guys, everybody. Kendra! Could happen. So, so tell me, I mean, you know, because I know that you also teach people who are on courses. Yes. yes. The whole line. So please tell us, because you got a really good story. Yes. yes. About that. So, we have yeah. a guy who trains with the St. Louis police. He had a traffic stop last week, and he's, he... Tried to get the gentleman out of the car. The guy resisted, held onto the officer's arm, started dragging him down North Broadway, of all places. Right. And then the officer jumps into the vehicle. They're both steering the car. And this guy was trying to ram them into light poles, rammed them into cars, said to the officer, I'm going to kill us both. At which point the officer says, he tells me the story, said, I could have reached for my gun, but he thought I have another way. And that way is jujitsu. He choked him unconscious, pulled the car to the side. Dragged him out of the car, and that's a story you didn't see about in the news because he used jujitsu. More officers should be training in jujitsu. That's really, really cool. It's a great story. That's right. That's right. If they know how to do it. And not everyone knows how to do it. Even if, let's say, I, I could show you one time, it doesn't mean you can go out and do it. Jeremy is a practice, officer's practice for years. Something you've got to be able to do it without thinking about it. So they should be training all the time. That's right. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Jamie Armin coming out here. We're going to be playing a game. It's going to be a lot of fun. The Fix. Let's go. Awesome. Thank you. Yes. Very nice.